Well, soon they will be getting on board to prove Starliner is part of the future of space. We were there as astronauts Sonny Williams and Butch Wilmore touched down at Kennedy Space Center today. They will be the first people to fly in the space taxi. Now, Starliner is billions over budget, also years behind schedule. And some of you are asking, is it really ready and is it safe? So News 6's James Barbero trekked out to where the astronauts landed to ask what our viewers want to know. All right, so I'm riding the bus out to the runway where the astronauts will land this afternoon. Most people remember this as the old space shuttle runway. Under the commercial crew program now, we've watched nine crews for SpaceX land here in the last four years. Now, finally, the first two Starliner astronauts will arrive at KSC ahead of their historic flight to the International Space Station. As we wait for Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams, I have a few minutes to tell you how we got to this point. I recorded this video of Starliner's first uncrewed flight at the end of 2019, and that test never made it to the space station because of a technical issue. Then in 2022, when Starliner flew for the second time without a crew, Boeing's capsule did reach the ISS, but again, there were more technical difficulties. And the setbacks continued as recently as a year ago, including with the parachutes, which had to be replaced. With all the corrections, now NASA says the spacecraft is ready to fly Butch and Sunny. I still see some of your comments, though, questioning Starliner safety. Look what some people wrote on this new story we just posted this morning on ClickOrlando.com. Your concerns are what I'm going to base my question on to the astronauts. Hi, Butch. Hi, Sunny. I'm James. I'm our local reporter at Channel 6. Given how publicized the delays for your mission have been, could you tell our audience more each of you why you believe the spacecraft is as safe as possible? Thank you. James, thank you. That's a good question. I mean, that's a, that's a fair question. Why do we think it's as safe as possible? We wouldn't be standing here if we didn't. We are ready. The spacecraft's ready. Yeah, I just want to add to that. I have all the confidence in, you know, not only our capabilities, the spacecraft capabilities, but also our mission control team who's ready for the challenge, and they're up for it, and they're, they're getting ready back in Houston. And here in Florida, Butch and Sonny now wait for their launch date at their astronaut crew quarters. The launch is currently scheduled for Monday, May 6th, at 10.34 at night. At NASA's Kennedy Space Center, I'm James Sparvero, Getting Results News 6. Fingers are crossed for them. Because I remember covering that. And I, I know you went to Houston, went to Houston when they announced, when they the they announced both SpaceX yeah. and the Boeing teams. And SpaceX has had a lot more success. They have. But let's hope for the best. May 6th. Mm -hmm. Looking forward to it.